And welcome to Orbix's Oceana County Airport rerun. Uh, a big apology to the guys at Orbix because last time I installed it, I didn't install it properly. So all I was doing is looking at the original airport. So let's go have a look and see what it really looks like. And let's go take a quick fly in the Robin around this really nice airport. See you soon. Welcome to Let's Fly VFR. All in next plane 11. Props, jets, and much more. All done in real world weather. Let's make it as real as possible every fly. Subscribe, like, and leave me a comment. Look forward to hearing from you. Well, here we are parked at Oceano County Airport. This is uh, a free airport, one of a few that are available for uh, X-Plane 11 now. Um, this one has 1.2 metre per pixel resolution. A lot of uh, custom auto scenery and auto gen, vegetation and trees, which are really good actually. And I just love the fact that there's some grass there. I'm so tired of just seeing flat ground, you know, around the airport. So as you can see, We've got uh, quite a number of buildings and airports. It's, look, I would still say it could do with some life. There's nothing that actually has animated this airport. It'd be nice if something was out of few aeroplanes, there was a few people around, but overall, it's a really great airport. And for free, no, it's pretty good. And uh, if you saw my last one, I was just looking to be impressed. Well, I'm pretty impressed with this one. This is uh, really good. And I get really great frame rates. I am at max on my, uh, uh, settings my object slider is maxed out I'll give you a quick look at that in a minute when we get there so let's taxi out and take a quick flight you can see all the grass you can see the buildings down on the left very well modeled if you look at the uh, the photographs of the actual airport uh, even the rust stains seem to be about right I'll try and get my rudder straight and let's hoof off into the wild blue yonder I'm still in a bit of trouble with those it's all right we'll get there anyway we're off new to the channel please feel free to give us a subscribe bash that like button if you're already subscribed it helps us out a great deal get another perspective on the takeoff but more importantly have a look at the trees and the grass and the vegetation around here even the fencing there's so much minor detail that's uh, that's done so well there are a few people hanging around outside the, the main shed there and I'm trying to go sideways and do a bit of rallying in the robin not one of my best takeoffs I've got to say Especially that bit, but never mind. We get off, and you can see all the um, custom auto gen out there on the outside. It's actually quite close to town, so we've got. Uh, looks like we've got some vineyards down there, vineyards down there, maybe all the uh, the rows of trees there. Could be citrus. Home area would be citrus. So let's have a look at the countryside. So. Um, Resolution's still very good around here as we head around in, in the downwind. Have a little look at all the uh, the scenery as we go. Still really enjoying this robin as well. The aero, the aero Basque Robin 401. It's uh, it's been a lot of fun. I've been enjoying flying it, getting a little bit more to grips with it, enjoying it a little bit more. With the exception of my uh, my rudder work and take off. So you can see out across the countryside, down the beach, looks really good. Now there's some, uh, there's a whole range of these free airports around. Um, today I saw a video made by Ausflight Simmer, Shane, and he pointed out uh, this one and, and a number of others as well. So maybe I'll link uh, Shane to the notes above, and if you want to go and have a look at the other free airports are out by Mr. X and others. Uh, Prop Strike Studios is another one too. If you're looking for something in Canada, they have those. I might link all those below. Uh, I'm going to do a review of the Prop Strike aircraft airport very soon. Just in the process of putting that together. And there we are. We have the, um, looks like it's a sewerage or waterworks of some sort out the back there. Probably servicing the town that's uh, right nearby. 
all the private hangars down there. Um, you know, maybe a couple of open ones with some people and some uh, uh, aircraft, maybe in those tea hangars would be nice. Just a little touch, it's not much, but what a lot of the airports, like the small ones anyway, is some sort of animation and feeling that they're alive, which is a lot to see. So here you can see my uh, settings. Um, uh, they're up reasonably well. You can always scroll back and have a and pause if you want to have a quick look at them. For the uh, airport uh, in Canada that I'm about to do, another free airport, um, I had to pull them back a bit because the trees were just, there was just so many trees in the forests that uh, I was knocked back from a decent frame rate to something un unacceptable. So, like all things with simulators, you've just got to do with what you've got to do to make it smooth. So here we come, around on to final. Hope you don't mind the music in the background. It's a backing track with me murdering my Les Paul. Always a bit of fun. Love, love doing that. Anyway, here we go. Coming over some towns. There's a fair amount of auto gen there, isn't there? The towns are there. They're not just uh, appearing as we come in close. Get this nice and lined up. Hopefully we get a decent touchdown on the, ap the approach coming in. Flaps are already down. It's looking good on the way in. Coming over those trees. You can see those buildings over on the right as well. Here we go, runway 11, nose up, bit of a flare, a little bit of a balloon. There we are, down on the mains. So let's uh, just roll out and then I'll uh, catch it with you again as we come into the main area as well. And we'll have a look at the buildings a little bit closer as we finalise everything. We are back at the main section of the airport. Cross over runway 11, give it a quick look, make sure there's no one coming in. Doesn't it look good? Trees and the uh, with the waving flag up there, maybe. Let's taxi in and get some fuel, right? Eh? Actually, run. Uh, Rides out of, here, out of here in something resembling that aeroplane. Probably it's the, it's the right one. I'm sure the guys at Orbitz have got a, uh, a picture of the actual aircraft. I'll pick up and pull up here to get some fuel. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed our uh, little quick trip around Orbitz's Oceana County Airport. Feel free to either have a look in the link below or we'll search for it and you'll uh, get that they have a number of aircraft there's two more uh, aircraft, uh, aircraft airports available uh, for x-plane 11 at the moment there as well so you're welcome to go up there and download those and uh, I also highly recommend this Robin as well so it's been a lot of fun flying around okay so that's it wrapped up had a good look I uh, hope you guys have all had a great day. I will catch you in the next video. And uh, keep flying. That's all I can say. Just keep flying. Keep getting those rudder pedals moving. Catch you again real soon. Bye-bye. Let's make it as real as possible every fly. Subscribe, like, and leave me a comment. Look forward to hearing from you.